We have reports that senior al-Qaeda commander Mokhtar Belmokhtar has been killed. Belmokhtar led the attack on a gas plant in southern Algeria in January, where 37 hostages were killed. Sky News reporter Sam Kiley has more. The uh, Chadian authorities have said in a television broadcast, which, uh, if, which, which should give the report some credence, I think, if they're going to go national with this, said that they had uh, killed uh, uh, Belma, uh, Mokhtar Belmokhtar uh, in a major assault in which uh, dozens of uh, terrorists were killed, in their words, uh, including the leader uh, of the terrorist attack in southern Nigeria on the gas plant. Now, uh, if confirmed, and it is likely uh, to be confirmed, uh, then this is a major breakthrough in the uh, counter-terrorist operations in northern Mali, or in that whole area, the uh, known uh, generically now as the Maghreb. Uh, not least because last Thursday, uh, another leader, in fact the leader of al-Qaeda in the Islamic Maghreb, a man called Abu Zaid, uh, is also reported to have been killed in a very heavy uh, French airstrike. So uh, in the space of a few days, if uh, the DNA results uh, are proven on Abu Zaid, he's being tested or his remains are being tested uh, in Algeria against some of his relatives. This would be a major blow to al-Qaeda in the Islamic M Maghreb, but also, of course, uh, a hugely significant development in terms of the uh, punishment, if you like, of those groups that were involved uh, in the atrocities in southern Algeria just a few weeks ago.